Hey guys, John Wilford here. So recently I had a little bit of a breakthrough that I wanted to share with you. I put out a response video to Owen Benjamin and I got about six views in a couple hours, which I know that, that doesn't sound like anything and for most YouTubers it's not, but for a channel like mine without any subscribers, it was it was a significant jump. In those views I actually got a comment back and I had, had very little uh, video retention throughout that on, you know, if you look at the watch times. And the comment said, hey John, you seem like a very nice guy, uh, but you got to find something better to do with your time. I don't think making entertaining videos is for you or something along those lines. And I went back, I looked at my videos and I realized that he's absolutely right. Uh, I was coming across as very socially disconnected uh, in the videos and I was not reaching anybody. I wasn't connecting. I, went, I didn't even feel connected to myself whenever I watched them. And so I started looking at why that was, and I came up with two reasons and, and solutions for those reasons. Uh, reason one was I was sitting sitting back very relaxed, and while uh, that kind of environment is is you know good for for a, I guess candid or or relaxed response, it it wasn't good for staying focused on my audience uh, because whenever you're watching this. Uh, you need to get the sense that I'm speaking to you and connecting with you. Uh, but whenever I'm recording it, all I get to see is, well, this. And that's not very easy to connect with from my end. So I end up kind of looking all over the place. And I have ADD anyway, so that's that's a difficult one for me to do. So by sitting up, it, it kind of activates my muscles and forces me to realize actively that I'm in the middle of a video and really need to be paying attention to this camera. The other thing I did is I wrote down everything before I started talking. Now I'm, I'm not reading it word for word and in fact uh, from what I wrote to what I'm saying there's been quite a few changes. However, it helped me organize my thoughts really well and really reduce the, uh, the lag time and collecting my thoughts while I'm talking. So I'm going to start doing that. Another thing that I'm going to start doing on my videos is if they start going a little bit long, I'm going to start doing cut edits. I've seen a lot of these. Uh, it's not the format that I'm used to, especially in our podcast. It's very candid. Um, but whenever you're doing this kind of stuff, it's really important because keeping that, that rhythm going in a video is difficult. I know whenever we're on the podcast and one of us hangs up, the other one can just jump in there and kind of keep things moving, but there's not that ability uh, in this kind of format. So anyway, uh, that's kind of what I had to share. I hope you enjoyed this video, or at least enjoyed it more than my last one, and I was more engaging. Um, at, you know, at first when I started making these, it was just kind of for me. Uh, but then I realized I'm kind of putting this out in a public forum. I'm spending, you know, 20, 30 minutes of my life just recording these. And then uh, on top of that, there's editing time. And I might as well make it in a coherent fashion. Um, if I walked in up to somebody on the street and presented myself in the very same kind of way that I was presenting myself in these videos, they'd think I was mentally defective. So I really need to take a little bit of time to realize the medium by which I'm communicating and communicate with that. So if somebody does come across it and wants to see it, uh, it's engaging to them. Or at the very least, if they play this at my funeral one day, they don't say, oh, there was John. He, he was slow. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, uh, give it a thumbs up. Uh, let me know if I did better uh, in the comments. Uh, if you want to see more, subscribe, uh, you know, back to my original video. I'm not going to hold myself to a strong format on when I'm going to put these out or anything, but I'll keep going as I can. So anyway, we'll talk to you later.